Hello, YouTube. My name is Trey. Welcome to What Can I Change? And we're going to talk about a guy who wants to take off his shirt. Now, this looks like an older video. Can't play the music because it's that. Bye, my key pineapple. You know. So. So, anyway, she's telling me to put my shirt back on because others feel insecure. These two people in the back and no way back there aren't even looking. These are all women. And this is a Joel Swole video, just to prove that. Joel Swole goes on to talk. So, but he's, <laughs> we're not here for his opinion. We're here for mine. So, um, so Joel Swole um, says that what really happened is this individual got told to put his shirt back on because it's, uh, because of the employees, uh, because it's a uh, policy. Here's the thing, man, and I'm going to be honest with you, and I, I'm not the, obviously I'm not in the best shape of my life, so I'm not going to get on here and be like, oh, yeah, 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 but dude, look, uh, let's be honest with ourselves here. Look, let's look at this man's body again. Let's look at his body. I don't think anybody's insecure about that. I think, I think he's even laughing. I, he must be making a joke. This has to be a troll. He said, I, sh I tell her, sure, but it's not my fault. I'm so jacked. He is not jacked from anything I've ever seen. Um, I, I would consider Joel Swole, uh, I, was, I would consider like Beast Mode Jones, Chris Jones. I would consider him jacked. I would consider some of these natural bodybuilders jacked. I would consider Greg Dujet, Coach Greg, jacked. This guy looks like some guy who just got a low body fat percentage Hits the gym, but he ain't Jack. Um, because you, you don't, I don't see no cuts in those arms. Well, of course, he could be bulking. And if he's bulking, then, I mean, he's, he'd be even smaller than that. So, I don't see Jack. Next, insecurity. He makes people in there in the gym insecure. Nobody's insecure looking at you, bud. Okay? Most people who go to the gym don't care if somebody's got the shirt off. Are there people in there who get insecure? Yes. But if you guys have been to a gym, there's people who are fat as heck. Like myself, who's gone to the gym. Okay, we're the only people who may feel a little insecure, but I didn't. I don't look at other people in the gym, and even if they have their shirt off, do I think insecure? You're normally focused on yourself, right? So I don't think it was definitely an insecurity. And most of the people in this gym look like women, so they probably really aren't. They're probably just creeped out by you, dude. But in all honesty, it was policy. Most gyms don't let you take off your shirt. A lot of gyms don't do that, especially commercial gyms. They're not going to let you take off your shirt. Um, just because it's not that kind of gym, you know, every gym has their own policy. You want to go take off your shirt, go home. I have a, I have a gym here at my house. I could take off my shirt if I feel like it to work out. You know what I mean? And to be honest, I'm i I'm not going to be a hypocrite here. <laughs> I have taken my shirt off at the gym, but there was nobody in there. I've only taken off my shirt at the gym when there was nobody in there and I didn't work out. I would just take off my shirt right after working out just to see how I'm looking all right, I, I try to take my fitness pretty serious. So, yeah, I do look at my body, see what we're doing, see how fat my gut looks, you know. Like, guys, I've completely changed my eating habits, and so we're starting to look better. But, yeah, I got to look at my body. I, I, I know I got um, man boobs, so I look at all that stuff in the gym. I try to see where I'm making progress, where I'm not making progress, all that kind of stuff. And it's easier to do it in a gym mirror than at home because I don't have a big freaking gym mirror, right? So, yeah, I've taken my shirt off, but I never do it in front of people. I watch, and if somebody was to walk in on me, I put my shirt back on. And I would tell them, hey, I'm, I'm just checking out progress. That's it. Not trying to, I don't put it on no camera. I'm not putting them, I'm not putting on my phone for a TikTok. I ain't doing all that. I can do that here at home if I'm going to do a TikTok and all that kind of stuff. I don't make TikToks, as you notice. So, for me, man, keep your shirt on. Respect the policy. Ain't nobody insecure about you, bro, I'm sure. And even if they were, why would you do that to make people feel insecure? I don't understand people who would do that kind of stuff anyway. Why would you take off your shirt and just be, oh, I want people to feel insecure? Why? It sounds like you're the insecure one. Come on, headphones. Work with me, baby. God, I'm getting some new headphones eventually. I just have to order them, and it kind of sucks. They have to be special made so um, because I can't find any hook ones that are wired. And By the way, I don't use Bluetooth headphones because I... I use a thing for this and uh, my XLR, so I need headphones. I can't use wireless, or I wouldn't be able to connect to this thing. Anyway, you let me know what you guys think, man. Um, if you're insecure, if you think you make people feel insecure, I don't understand why you would do it. 
just go to the gym. Why do you need to take off your shirt to make other people feel bad? That's just crazy to me. But let me know what y'all think. I'm about out of here. Peace.